The young African entrepreneur is probably the most dynamic anywhere in the world. Because of how difficult the entrepreneurship ecosystem is in Africa, we always tell them that if you succeed as an entrepreneur in Africa, you can succeed anywhere. And what we're finding is an amazing innovation, especially in areas like renewable energy. But we now have entrepreneurs who are, who are using solar power and, and, all, and renewable energy to create an, an electricity in their communities. And that's absolutely critical to economic growth. One of my favorite ones is one of our female entrepreneurs from Malawi, and she created um, a solar bag. So it's a bag that charges your phone just with solar power. And it's just amazing. And we have another entrepreneur in Rwanda who we actually saw at the UK summit. And she came to us and she said the $5,000 we gave her was her first ever seed capital. Today, she's been able to raise $3 million, and she's the largest exporter of fruits and vegetables from Rwanda. We need partners, we need governments, we need development finance institutions to understand that the only way to curb extremism and illegal migration is to create economic opportunity on the African continent. Once you do that, 90% of Africa's problems will be solved. The only reason that Africans risk their lives on the Mediterranean Sea and go into unknown areas in the, in, in, is they're looking for economic opportunity. If they have it in their home, they wouldn't go elsewhere looking for it. Through entrepreneurship, they can create jobs not just for themselves, but for others as well. And we're seeing that our entrepreneurs go on to create a minimum of five jobs. So that is the only sustainable solution for the unemployment problem across Africa.